All right, clouds continue to build as we look live outside from Dodge and 680 here back to the southeast. 87 degrees already. Here's the problem though, 71 degree dew point. That humidity for this time of day near 60% is very high. It's extremely uncomfortable. In fact, we'll look at the heat index values in just a moment. So far, most of the rains avoided the metro. Look what it's done to temps up in Norfolk though. It's dropped you guys down to 70 and then everybody else between about 85 and say 89 degrees as we head to the southeast. This is what it feels like though when you add in the humidity right now. 93, that's the heat index value. 96 in Plattsmouth, even southwestern Iowa, we'll many spots there up above 90 degrees. All right, in and around the metro, we've been seeing some of those clouds try to build. Not much in the way of rain yet, although that's a little bit different story as we look back to the northwest. One round earlier this morning, and look at these storms that have refired in the wake of the initial shot there up around Norfolk. Uh, here's what we're watching. Again, some energy kind of coming in from the southwest. As I was saying on the way to break, this area being monitored for potential weather watch here over the next couple of hours through the afternoon and early evening. Even a secondary little line of showers and storms in the parts of western Iowa there. So the forecast map through the afternoon, it has picked up on the storms off to the northwest of us. Uh, we'll watch closely. It indicates at least some development tries to take shape here the, during the afternoon. And then by this evening, the threats really slide east of the Missouri River. So I think it's kind of going to be through about 4 or 5 o'clock, maybe 6 p.m. And then things will move off to the east there. Here's the updated look from the Storm Prediction Center. Once again, uh, we continue to adjust the enhanced area just east of the Missouri River. We are under the slight risk still. And again, I think that would be now between about 5 or 6 o'clock. We'll have to watch primarily for maybe some large hail and some gusty winds. So with that, in between partly sunny 90 this afternoon, Overnight then, the storm threat's out of here quickly. We'll drop to 68. We'll be dry, quiet, and clearing. Then the heat comes right back in here tomorrow. 95 Wednesday, 95 on Thursday, and then temperatures as we head towards the rest of the week. Stay hot for the start of the College World Series. Opening ceremonies Friday evening will be warm. And if you're thinking about taking in a game down at the ballpark there on Father's Day, 98, Matthew, in the afternoon.